Hey guys, Tech with the video for you guys. In today's video, we're gonna show you how to print from your iPhone to a wireless printer, like the one that I have here, all the requirements that you need in order to be able to print directly from your iPhone. So let's get started. So in order to be able to print from your iPhone to a wireless printer like this one that I have, first requirement is that your printer that you have has to be a wireless printer or this will not work. So here I have iPhone, I have a wireless printer, this is a Samsung one, it's an older version one and the thing you need about this one is you also need to ensure that that has an NFC as well for some of the printers that are older for an error to work but make sure it's a wireless printer. And the next requirement is that the network that your wireless printer on has to be the same network that your iPhone is on for the Wi-Fi. So if you go into your uh, setting of your iPhone, right, under your settings here, whatever Wi-Fi setting name you have, it needs to be the same one that your printer is connected to once you uh, initially set it up. If it's not on the same Wi-Fi, it will not pick it up. So those are the two big requirements. Is a lot of times people are trying to print from a wireless printer, but they're not on the same a Wi-Fi network, so make sure it's the same Wi-Fi network. And after you have that, you're ready to be able to print from your wireless printers. So in order to print, most people print from their uh, files app. If you saved a document or something on it, it's gonna look and come up here. Let's say I wanna print maybe uh, this paper that I have. Well, I need to find the print option, and the print option generally will be with this icon up here where you see that arrow pointing up. If you click on that, you should see a print option. Now, if you don't see it right here, the other option you can click on is top right here with my paper, and you'll see here there's the option to print. Now, if you click on that option, you need to find your printer. So by default, it might say no printer selected, and then if you click on it, it's gonna search for the wireless printer that's on the network. As you can see here, this model that I have, so I'll select that, and now I can do other pre set or such, and then I can click on that print option, it will print for me. Let's say um, I maybe I have another document I want to print or a photo like this one here. Like I said, generally it should just show up to you where you click on that arrow pointing upward and you should have a print button just like that. And as you can see here, initially it's going to say no printer selected, but if you click on it, it'll search it and then you have to select on it and then you can hit that print option and it'll start printing. So you can also do the same exact thing for a photo as well. If you have a, a document in your photo, right, maybe you have a photo here, like this one, right, you need to print, you can click on that icon, and then if you go down here, the print option is there for you. Now, when you click on the print option, sometimes you have to adjust the paper size as well. You'll see a preview here, so if you need to change that, you can adjust that accordingly to the paper size, so make sure you select the right size as well. And to show you that the printing works, I'll go ahead and click on my paper here that I have, and then I click on that icon, um, arrow pointing downwards here. So let me try this again. And then as you notice here, I can do print and then I'll select the printer here and then I click on print and then make sure your printer is on, of course, it's not on. And we will should see it print out any second now. And as you can see, it does take a minute or two, sometimes not the quickest printer, if you, especially this printer that I have, it's a little bit older version of printer, but you do have to be patient. And as you can see here, my printer just printed out the document for me just like that. So that's how you do a printing on your iPhone. I hope this video is helpful. If so, please make sure to like and subscribe button. Thanks for watching guys. See you guys next time.